Hello. I'm going to be having a giveaway soon. Um, I should have one now because I have 50 subscribers, but unfortunately I'm in school right now so I have to um, go to school and all that stuff so I'm not going to have the time to do the shopping until this weekend. And I've gotten some stuff for the giveaway already, but I need to finish up shopping for the giveaway. And I'll do that this weekend, so I will be filming a video for the giveaway this weekend. And, um, I have my uh, favorites for this month, and, or for last month, September. Oh gosh, I can't believe September's over. I mean, I... I wouldn't say that normally because I normally am okay with months being over, but it started to rain and got all cold all of a sudden and it's like summer was, isn't summer supposed to last or at least the warmth of summer is supposed to last until, you know, mid-October and now it's all rainy and cold, but anyways. Um, my favorites for this month, um, the first one is uh, MAC Mineralized Skin Finish, and this is in the color Light Plus, and um, this is the shade that a lady at the makeup counter picked out for me. Um, it is a little light, but it works. It was like February when I had this picked out for me, so I was probably a lot paler than I am now. But it works really well. I love it. Um, this is the one I reach for the most because this one I find matches my skin tone more often than um, any other uh, face powders I have. So I like that a lot. Another um, thing that I really like this month was the Chanel Vital Lumine Aqua. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce it. <laughs> I'm not gonna learn any time soon, so whatever. Anyways, this is um, a sample that was came in my Allure this month. Yeah, I think it was Allure. Yeah, it was Allure for October. It, it came with a Chanel Vitalumia Aqua sample. Anyways, um, it came in the color beige, which was perfect for my skin tone. I absolutely love this. I wish I had, you know, the extra $40, $50, whatever this costs to um, go out and buy this right now because um, this is awesome. It lasted all day, all day long. And it is just like so natural looking. I love it so much. And I didn't find it too greasy, which some foundations are too greasy or oily for my skin tone. I can't stand having like an oily, gross face. And um, a couple more face products. Um, this is... Wet n Wild and Princess, and this is a bronzer I've been enjoying this month, and it's really nice. It seems to work well with my skin tone, and I like that. And this is a new color that I just tried out, and I absolutely love it. This is Wet n Wild Mellow Wine Blush. And it is beautiful and sometimes it it's very pigmented so you have to use a really light hand and if I get too much on I'll just put a little face powder over top of it and it kind of evens it out a bit and makes it look like you're glowing so I just love this um, blush This just made it into my favorites. It is um, a concealer that my pen pal gave me. This is, I believe, the Classics is the brand. And it is a um, 
concealer and I found that this does not really like some concealers I have little fine lines under my eyes and some concealers they really accentuate that and this concealer does not do that it stays pretty much all day and it is the perfect color for my under eye circles usually like in America you can hardly find them this light this is such a light color and it's so perfect for hiding under eye circles I love it so much thanks Melissa and um, I got several lip products I have been enjoying several lip products this month um, whenever somebody compliments me on my lipstick I tend to put it in my favorites because I know not only did I like it but somebody else liked it also and this lipstick I got complimented on this is Essence More to Love and it is this sheer red that has sparkles in it it's really pretty and this lipstick I also got complimented on and this is um, Cherry Balm by Wet n Wild and it's a matte lipstick and it's this beautiful deep red I was wearing it my last video and several people complimented me on that and this lipstick also got some compliments this is Milani and Plum Rose and it's a beautiful plummy pink and this one I just love <laughs> I think it looks really nice on the lips it is um, flower cosmetics and it's in the shade sheer snapdragon and I got this because Emily Noel uh, was wearing it in one of her videos and I thought this was such a pretty color so I had to go out and get it and I love it it's really nice um, I got an eyeshadow quad that my pen pal also gave me and this is the brand classics again and this is Smoky Eyes Black. And I was wearing this the other day. I absolutely love these um, eyeshadows. They are so buttery smooth. They're just very pigmented, very smooth. They're very nice. And it's a great color combination to have. Um, I love it. I also love this um, Face of Australia Big Lash Mascara. It's the volumizing one. And I love it. I love the wand. This is exactly the type of wand that I love. The ones with the bristles everywhere. I find they're easier to build lashes with. And it's great. I absolutely love it. It smells really good too. I I think I smell eucalyptus in a lot of the Australian makeup that my pen pal gave me and I love that smell. I love the smell of eucalyptus so that's really cool. And then this nail polish also made it into my um, favorites and this is um, Milani and High Tech and I really like this nail polish. It's so glittery. It's a scatter holographic nail polish. It's gorgeous. And the last thing is something that I recently got at Ulta, and it's the Ulta pencil sharpener. And I needed a new pencil sharpener because um, my other pencil sharpener wouldn't sharpen my NYX Jumbo pencils. And so I asked them at the counter could they recommend a pencil sharpener that would work on the NYX Jumbo pencils and they gave me this so 
I love it. It works on the jumbo pencils. It also works on smaller, smaller pencils. It's perfect. Alright, so that's everything. Have a great day. Bye.